Hey guys and welcome back. Uh, just uh, did some grocery shopping and I thought I'd pick up a few things and give you guys an idea of prices of various fruits and vegetables in China. So let's start with the carrots. I'd say this is a, a little bit over a pound, a uh, pound and a quarter. This was 2.5 renminbi and I'll go over the exchange at the end, but 2.5 renminbi. All right, two large potatoes. These were one and a quarter renminbi. The onion was one and a quarter renminbi. Bananas was two renminbi. Uh, the eggs, 150, 1 1.5 renminbi. And let's see, let's go over to the, the head of lettuce here. This one was two renminbi. Cucumbers, two renminbi. A little bit of, uh, or a bunch of cilantro here. It's really nice. They eat this in almost everything here. One renminbi. And let's go over to the tomatoes. All right, nice tomatoes here. Uh, these were 1.75 renminbi, so one and three quarters. Uh, it's about a pound and a quarter of grapes. This was a little, uh, these are a little bit more expensive, about, a, you know, seven renminbi. Uh, now, the most expensive thing is this, a lemon. This was 12 renminbi for just one lemon because it's not grown here. They've got to import these. I've seen some of them imported from California or Thailand or things like that, Hawaii, but they don't, uh, they don't grow lemons here, or at least in this part of China. So all of this, if you guys kept track, was 32.25 renminbi which the exchange rate last I checked this morning was 6.8 renminbi to the dollar. So all these fruits and vegetables cost $4.74. All right, oh, did I, did I do the pepper? Yeah, the pepper was one renminbi, if I'm not mistaken. All right, so just wanted to give you guys uh, an overall idea so you can get all of this for less than $5. Typically what we'll do is you'll cut up the tomato or potatoes, throw in some cilantro, mix in a little bit of peppers, and that's one dish right there for, you know, the family. They'll, they'll, they'll fry some eggs with some rice, throw in some onions, pepper, uh, carrots, very thinly sliced, and there you go. You've got yourself, you know, a Chinese meal. Now you might be asking yourself, where is the meat? And I ask myself that this <laughs> almost every single day. Um, I would say I am a huge meat eater when I am not in China. Um, I, in one of the other videos when I was at the market, the vegetable market and meat market, you guys saw that. Um, the meat is out. They don't refrigerate it. So it doesn't, it doesn't look very safe to me. I've, been, I've had food poisoning in the past and I really don't want to deal with that. Oh, my neighbor is playing her piano. I don't know if you guys can hear. But um, anyway, there's not a lot of meat. Occasionally, I'll get chicken breasts from the one grocery store and it's sealed. You know, it, it looks like it's sold in the States. And if I can get over to Metro, which is a foreign grocery store here, they do have ground beef. But outside of that, I don't cook very much meat at home. Now, I bought the potatoes, onion, pepper, carrots, and cilantro, and I'm going to make a curry dish tomorrow night. But tonight I'm just going to eat some noodles and uh, some, some of the fruit, you know, grapes and bananas and stuff like that. But anyway, I just wanted to give you guys a heads up. So this is less than $5 for all this food. Anyway, I hope you guys enjoyed it. And if you have any questions or comments, you know, just shoot me a message. And please subscribe. It would really help me out. Check out my Patreon page. And don't forget next month I am taking a trip. And uh, I actually posted this on Patreon, but I haven't done a video about it. I changed my mind. We're not going to a room she, but I'm also not going to tell you where I'm going until the day of the trip. If all goes well, that should be August 21st. And uh, a friend of mine and I, Alex, he works with me at, the, at my kindergarten. We're going to go on a trip, and, uh, but I won't give you guys any hints as to where I'm going just yet. But... Uh, what I'll do is uh, an hour before I leave for the airport, I will do a quick video, maybe live, post it for you guys, and then basically post the entire trip, you know, 
taxi to the airport, checking into the airport, you know, waiting for the plane, getting on the plane, arriving and where, wherever we're going, you know, and everything like that from start to finish and give you guys a whole rundown of how much it costs me, you know, prices for the tickets, transportation, hotel, food and stuff like that. Anyway, that's going to be in about three and a half weeks. So anyway, I hope you guys enjoyed this. Please subscribe and I will see you guys in the next video. Have a great day. Bye-bye.